Hey guys, thanks for watching my next video and for checking out my channel, uh, as always. This one is called Prediction Coins. What I've got here on the table are eight little wooden coins. Uh, they're about the size of a quarter. You can pick up a bag of them at, uh, at a hobby store or a craft store. And on the face of each of them, I've drawn a different uh, little symbol or a shape. Uh, we've got a, a square, an X, a star, triangle, circle, heart, waves, and an hourglass. And in a moment, we're going to play a little bit of a game with these coins. But the first thing I want the, uh, the spectator to do is to uh, just look them over. Just clear your mind, look over each of these shapes individually, and uh, just kind of focus on each one. And while you're doing that, I'm going to uh, take this pad here, and I'm going to write down a prediction for later. I'll do that off camera so you can't see. And again, if there was somebody here, I just invite them to look over the shapes, clear their mind. And once I've made my prediction, I will fold it up, place it on the table. Just like so. Now I said we're going to play a little bit of a game with these coins, and here's what we're going to do. If there was somebody here, I would uh, gather up these coins and hand them to somebody, and they would shake them up, just like dice, and they would drop them onto the table. Any of them that land face up, like this, will keep. Any of them that land face down, like that, will get rid of, will eliminate. And we'll keep doing that, keep shaking them and tossing them, uh, until there's only one left. So if there was somebody here, I would invite them to hold out their hand. I would hand these to them. Invite them to shake them up, and whenever they want, just drop them all onto the table. Just like that, and we've, uh, we've gotten rid of half of them, just on the first shake. We've gotten rid of the triangle, the star, the waves, and the circle. So we'll, uh, we'll just put these aside up here, and we're down to four, just like that. Again, I'd have them hold out their hand, hand them to them shake them up again, and we get rid of one more. We get rid of the square, so we'll put that one aside, down to three. Shake them up, toss them, Oop. this one went off camera, so I'll do it again. Heart stays face up along with the X, and we get rid of the hourglass. Only two left, so I'd give them to them, shake them up, drop them, and only the X is face up. We get rid of the heart, leaving us with the X. Now we started with eight, and uh, you could have had essentially any one of these eight shapes based on maybe how you shook them or how you threw them onto the table. Any one of these could have been our final selection. But we ended up with the X, which just happens to be what I wrote down at the very beginning. So this one is called Prediction Coins, and this one's kind of a kid's trick. Uh, it might be uh, kind of easy to figure out. If you're watching at home, you might be able to uh, tell how this one is done, uh, but I like it. It's something different. It's not a card trick. Uh, it's just kind of something different and a, a fun trick. You can make this one yourself. I bought, uh, I bought a bag of these uh, little uh, wooden circles here. It was, uh, I think, $1.99 at a craft store. So this is one you can make yourself. And uh, thank you guys again for watching, and I'll see you next time.